Many times when I'm running my programs on personal branding or advanced communication, I sometimes get professionals reaching out and saying, hey, I really feel that I've lost my personality. And it's very true. You see, when you are working in a world of conformity, sometimes you'll find that you have become very devoid of tonality and personality and you become boring as a person. So what can you do about it? The well, first thing you need to understand is that children are never boring. You see, all children are charismatic because they are in full natural expression. However, as children grow up and they go through the education system and then the work system, a lot of the times that same individual expression is discouraged and as a consequence professionals become devoid of personality and tonality. The second thing that you can do is to take some more risks. You see children take risks, that's how they learn. But when we grow up, a lot of the times we stop doing new things. When we stop doing new things, we become very predictable and when we become predictable, we naturally become boring. So start taking some risks, start doing some new things. After all, life is not permanent. If you keep doing the same thing, you're going to keep getting the same results. The third thing that you can do to unlearn being boring is to express yourself more. Don't worry about what other people are going to think. Yes, I know it takes a lot of courage to stand for what you believe, but you're going to start to earn your self-respect and your whole personal and psychological disposition is going to change when you start to stand up for what you believe. The fourth thing is take a stance for something that you're really passionate about. You see, when you're half-hearted and you're sitting on the fence about you know, what is right and what is wrong and what you believe and what you don't believe in, if you become too agreeable, you're actually not being authentic. And when you're not being authentic, you naturally don't come across as charismatic and you end up coming across as quite boring as a person as well. And the last thing I would suggest is don't necessarily avoid conflict. Conflict can be good and there is a lot of social value in honest disharmony, sometimes more than there is in dishonest harmony. And so the fact is that if you really feel conflicted with somebody and you want to put your point of view forward and it seems like you're disagreeing or you're coming up with an argument, nothing wrong with that. You see, the world has progressed, humanity has progressed because of debates and arguments. It is important that you have the courage to be able to put your point of view forward and not feel that you need to be agreeable and you need to sit on the fence with every perspective that you have. Now, if you do these things, you'll find that your natural charisma will start to shine again. Most people are naturally charismatic. We don't have to learn to be interesting. We simply have to unlearn being boring.